As they say shall never ever end in this world who will have thought that our popular gospel musician Osinachi Nwanchuku will die in the ends of her husband so guys do not go anywhere if you really want to find out the fujis of how her husband is involved in her deaths this is really sad and very very shocking so guys, just stay tuned to find out the full details of how she really passed on to eternal glory. Hello everyone, hope you all are doing good. If you are new here and you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, what are you waiting for? Please kindly click the subscribe button and also to my new subscribers, you are welcome to my YouTube channel and to all my returning subscribers, I really appreciate you all for always coming back to watch my new upload. So guys, let's dive right in into the main reason for this video. So last night, being the 8th of April, the news and the death of Osinachi Uwanchuku came as a shock to a lot of people because this is a woman that has blessed a lot of life with her angelic voice and her songs are always so epic and they are always fed to the inner parts of the soul. So when her death broke into the internet, a lot of people were so sad and the news was that she was battling with cancer for a long time and she has been on life support for two months before she passed on to eternal glory yesterday which is the 8th of April to throat cancer. So people were so sad and a lot of people were angry and this beautiful musician just dropped a new music six days ago before her death on YouTube. So people were wondering who posted the music and why nobody informed her fans that she was going through a lot so they could pray for her. Not until this morning that we are hearing a different news from a whole lot of people. The whole story has changed. The whole narrative has changed because so many people have come out to say that she didn't die to cancer, but rather her husband is fully involved in her death. In fact, her husband actually made her to lose her soul. So right now, I'll be reading some of the evidence so you can see it for yourself. This is not just a made-up video. A lot of people have said this, like a lot of people have shared their own opinion about this, that her husband always deal with her at home always treat her so badly this is really really so surprising who have thought that she has been going through a lot in her matrimonial home so guys i'll be reading some of the evidence for you all to hear so someone posted this on facebook she said so this is true sister osinachi Nwanchuko, who sang a koimi is dead and the most annoying part of it all is that she was scared by her husband Sister Osinachi, husband, has been beating and maltreating this woman not until he kicked her on the chest. She has been on life support since five days and finally died yesterday. She couldn't hold on anymore. The husband has now been arrested and I pray he rots in jail. I keep saying this, you don't have to endure marriage. Marriage is meant to be enjoyed. Who you marry is better than marriage itself. My people, rest in peace, a great icon. Your voice lives on. So this is just from one person. And another person also posted this. This is from Chidima Ezeugo. She said, I remember how it tied her up and asked the children to beat her up with cane. She told me this, like, this is coming from someone that she told this directly. Oh my god, I wish she left. I really wish she left or open up to a lot of people and seek for help. And then another person again, Brimstar Chidima, 
She said, Osunachi Matriko husband has beaten and maltreated this woman, but she's been dying in silence. Now, he kicked the woman on her chest and she's been on life support for five days and finally died. Now, the man has been arrested and I pray he rots in jail. And then another woman also said this. This is coming from someone that has seen Osunachi and how her husband treated her in her own presence. So the woman, Glory Solomon, posted this on Facebook. She said, I hosted her in one of my programs, The Invasion in 2019. It was terrible experience with the husband on phone and then when I arrived she shared scaring marital issue she has sneaked out of the house to honor the invitation the husband treated me on phone and assured me that the wife will not return to his house if she attend the event after we had paid and booked a flight to and fro so the woman also posted posters so that people will believe her that she's not just formulating the story so this is really so sad and i can't just believe that her husband could do this to her and just take away this amazing soul that has blessed so many life she has been blessed in life but we didn't know that she has been going through a lot in her home I wish we knew and a lot of people are also blaming pastors for not helping this woman heart because people say that the church she attend a pastor is fully aware of what is happening in her home but instead of them to advise her to take a walk and save her life they have been praying with her which is not bad to pray with her so but right now she's no more to even share a story with the world anymore she has gone to be with the lord and this is really heartbreaking i really really wish this didn't happen to this beautiful woman so this is a lesson honestly this is a lesson to all those that is experiencing such in their home do not wait do not assume do not wish and do not think that this particular person would change even if the person lets her change Run for your life first, at least save your life. Imagine she's a mother of four. Right now, those children doesn't have a mother anymore. And I know that she will... And I know that one of the reasons why she stayed would be because of her children. But right now, the children doesn't have any mother. And other people will take care of these children for her. So please, if you're experiencing this kind of things at home just take a walk and save your life first then you can continue praying for your partner for them to change anywhere you are as long as you have saved your life and this she experienced this for a lot of years not just one not just two she has not been happy i can't believe that a woman that has been blessing a lot of souls was not happy in her home so guys this is what really happened and this is the cause of her death according to a lot of people that has come out to say this so guys if you are watching this very moment please kindly subscribe to my channel and let's just pray that our soul rest in peace and we pray that justice will be served thank you all for watching do have a wonderful day or night ahead bye guys Amen. 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 Amen.
Amen. Amen. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you. Amen. 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 Lord of Jesus. Amen. Father, we thank you. Deborah, pray for mommy. Amen. 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 You shall not die. Amen. If the devils who are going to attack you, you shall go back to send Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Amen. Amen.